Hello everyone and good evening and I welcome you on the 6th, 7th and 8th channel of Baiju's. I am your teacher Ankita and a warm welcome to each one of you who are here with us. I hope that all of you can see me and can hear me clearly. Please do let me know in the chat box. Good evening everyone, good evening. We are meeting again today. And I think today is a jackpot day for class 8th, right? So many sessions for you guys. Right, we had a session in civics and now we have a session on history also. Good evening, good evening, Ritima, Adiva, Ankita, Manjeet, Garima, Vijni, Gungun, Shreya, S. Narendra, Deepti, Shorya, Ritima, Simran, Narendra, Kanishka, Archana, Yes, Gungun, Hi, Shelly, Mukesh, Mix Bag, Creative Zones, Ayushi, Radha, Archana, Hansika, Vaishnavi, Roman, Ayush, Snehal, Hansika, Ritu, good evening everyone, Lakshmi, Shruti, Aditi, Deepakshi. Yes, how are you all? I hope that all of you are doing good. And please do tell me everyone if you can see me clearly and can hear me clearly. Yo, yo, very warm welcome to each one of you here everyone in the today's class. So let's get started everyone. Today is a very, very important class, right? Now today the chapter that we have is very, very important from the exam point of view and in the history also, right? So in today's class, we will be discussing about the making of the national movement, the early phase of it, right? And a very, very, very uh, lovely chapter, I would say. So we'll be taking a look at this particular chapter, right? Now in this particular chapter, we will be discussing about that how right we have the understanding about the freedom so the last chapter we discussed about the women caste and reform we went back and we took about that how there were a lot of reforms which were happening and how the british actually helped but in today's class we will be discussing about that how the indians realized that british should leave our country and right we will be looking at the different events and movements that have happened during that particular time so I hope that all of you are clear that what we'll be doing in today's class. All of you give me a quick thumbs up if the agenda of today's class is clear. Yes, we do have menti. We'll be having the menti quiz after we're done with this particular session. And I will be sharing you the notes on Telegram. So you will get the notes on the Telegram. Awesome. Gilu have answered your question. Okay. Hi. Hi, Sajan. Welcome, good evening, good evening. Ready, right? All of you, I hope that all of you are ready, steady. Ready, steady and go. Awesome. So we are clear with that, that what we'll be doing in today's class. Now let's talk about that. What do you have to do now? If you are here in the class, please make sure to hit the like button. Go and quickly hit the like button, everyone. And if you're new here, please do take a moment and subscribe to the channel. Now I'll tell you other reasons why you should subscribe to the channel. But let's get into the class first, right? Stay with me throughout the session because of course we have the mentee quiz at the end and we will be discussing some other important points also. In today's class, we will be focusing on how you can write the answer and what are the important topics that are there from this particular chapter. This is a very long chapter, so we should be getting started. On that note everyone, please I hope that you are sitting with your history book. I have the history book with me. I hope that all of you also have your history book. Sit with the pencil also so that you can mark the important points. Okay, let's get started everyone. So in this particular chapter, right, we have these Britishers trying to control us, right? Yes, trying to control. So we know that when the Britisher came to our country, slowly, slowly they get into the system. Okay, you're going and getting your book, I'll wait. It's a story time, so I'll tell you, go and get your book. Yes. So we know that when the British came to our country, they said, we, were, we are just coming here for trade. We will not do anything. We are very good people, right? But slowly, slowly they realized that India is a very amazing country. It has so much wealth. So what they did, they started the dividing our country. They started applying the rules on our country. They started capturing the kings, taking their land, taking their power. And then they came into the power and that's how they got the hold of our countries. So, initially people were okay. People were, no, people were not aware of what's going on. People thought that yes, it's okay. They are, they are our guests. We should respect them. We should give them what they need. 
but later we realize that these people are not good and they are damaging our country and taking the wealth of our country. So by the time we realized it was a quite a uh, lot of layers which would happen at that particular time. So eventually it took us a lot of time to understand and then of course we started the rebel. So in class 8 only we have studied about that when and why people rebel. You remember the chapter? Radha, we will have for class 6 also. Don't worry. Yes, don't worry. Yes, you can stop spamming now. I understand. I got your point. But please don't spam now. Hi Tanvi, good evening. Yes, absolutely correct. It's in that particular chapter, we discussed about the true image of our Britishers, right? And of course, we discussed about the revolt of the 1857. So we remember that chapter, right? And of course, from there, we have gone into the details that how they took the charge of our land and they helped in some time here, right? They helped also in uh, having good reforms for our country. So in the 19th century, right, in the 19th century, the conquest and the takeover of the territories becomes more and more and they, they realize that we are oppo opposing so they applied more and more new regulation and the new laws were made. Secondly, of course, in the field, of course, in the education reforms, they definitely helped us. And of course, what happened? They actually, we saw that they actually took the opportunity from the farmers, from the traders, right? They captured the market. They increase the tax so that our Indian trader cannot do the business. So if they hampered our development of the industries and they definitely hampered our growth. And lastly, they suppressed the revolt in the 1857. So these are the things that Britishers did. Okay. During the British rule before the 19th century, right on at the onset of the 19th century, these are the things that were happening. Are we clear everyone? Yes. Hello, Imad, welcome to the class. Are we clear with this? Right, so we went back into the history and we are here now in present. Clear? Hi, Nibras, welcome to the class. Yes. Very good. So, Ankita, what are we discussing over here? We had a very quick, uh, very quick summary of what had happened in the class, right? So, we know that they came to our country, they took the power, they started having the different rules for our people. Then secondly, they played a very important role in giving us new reforms, education, especially help the women to uplift in the society. And third point is very important that they actually suppressed the condition, right? They deteriorate. Basically, uh, Shreya, that means ke if there's a good condition, because of their action, the condition becomes really very bad. So the peasants, the farmers, the traders lost so many of the money, they don't have jobs. And of course, they were in a lot of debt and they don't have any money left, right? So the, the condition, the, their social condition was not at all great. Clear? And then of course, the last is that somehow they managed to suppress the revolt of 1857. Are we clear? Yes. Suppression means basically daba dena. There was an increase, right, of their thoughts of our, of our people, right? They suppressed it. Yes. Very good, very good. So I hope that, right, uh, Ankita deteriorate means, bache ke chizu kharaab kar dena. Suman, right, means that they're actually helping women to uplift, right? They've actually helped the women to come uh, out from the shackles that were there in the, uh, that particular time. And it gives the women a chance, uh, gave the women a chance to come out and be more free. Everyone, I hope that it's, every one of you got it right. Narendra reform means change karna. They bring a lot of changes in the society. Good changes. Clear? Yes. Conquest, taking the charge of particular land. Okay. Very good. Let's move ahead everyone. So what were the Indian were thinking at that particular time? Indian were like, yeah, now it's time for all of us to, now it's time for all of us to go and do the revolt. So the revolt means rebel, right? Now, for example, you know that in at a place, someone is conspiring against the, conspiring against you. You are suppressed. You are not saying anything in the beginning. But when you realize, like, no, I will not allow it to happen, right? You're rising, you're raising your voice, you're fighting for your freedom, you're fighting for your thoughts. Clear? 
right? So that's what happened in our India also. And then Indian realized that it's the end. We have to stand for ourselves because nobody else will gonna take a stand for us. And that's how they started a long, long battle for the freedom. Are we clear? Yes, Subhi, we have Menti. Everyone, so here what we have in today's class. Let's take a screenshot, everyone over here. Right? You're right on time. We're just getting started. We had a great beginning. And now we are looking for the chapter. So everyone, in this particular chapter, you have these topics, right? We have the advent of Gandhiji. We have the growth of the Marsh nationalism. We will be discussing about the partition of Bengal and its aftermath. We will be discussing about the Indian National Congress, its foundation and its activity and political association and rising discontent. Okay? Yes, that's very good. It's okay. Shravya, welcome to the class. Right. Shushant, what do you think is the meaning? Everyone, can you help your friend Shushant with this? Sauvignon, right? I'm sure, I'm sure we all have heard about this word. Mass nationalism means a unity, a word that we have. All of us coming united. Yes. Awesome. Very good, everyone. So I hope that all of you are clear. Ankita will discuss about nationalism. They have mentioned over here. Right, Deepthi have mentioned unity. Thank you, Arjuna. Sovereigns means ruling, right? Independence. Independent people is the meaning of sovereigns. We are out of the ruling part, right? We are actually ruling something. We are the controller. We have the control. Okay? Jali. So everyone, I want all of you to focus over here. Right? How many of you are here? 60. Awesome. So let's get started. We had the base set now. Right? We are clear with the base now. And now we will be looking ahead. So one small request everyone. Right? One small request for all of you. Please make sure to focus in the class. I want less of the chat now. Let's focus here in class mode. And very importantly everyone. Right? Please make sure to note down important points. Thumbs up. Right? Very good, very good. Please do ask the doubts, but please make sure okay, you're focusing in the class. Awesome. And I hope that each one of you have hit the like button. Yes. So let's get started, everyone. So we know that, you know, uh, we know now what is the meaning of independence. And we know that what was the condition of a country. Yes. So now when we talk about this all, we always go back into the history and then talk about this slowly, slowly people realize the importance of association, right? People realize that we have to come together and we have to form an association, a mindset, same, same mindset people coming together and planning for the freedom. So during that particular time, we have a lot of political association. Right? We have the establishment of the political association during the 1870s and 1880s. Right? We have Pune, Surajika Sabha. Everyone, these names are really important. Yes, so please let's make sure to remember all of these names. So one of the name of the association, such association is Pune, Surajika Sabha. We have Mumbai Presidency Association. Indian Association and Indian National Congress. Clear, right? We are clear. You just have to remember the names. <coughs> clear only the names. There's nothing for here to us to understand. People came together and they started forming the association. Then, of course, among these, their goal was to build a nation together, unite the nation together, have to enlist the feeling of nationalism. Right? Nationalism in India means that all of us have a feeling of one nation. All of us want the freedom. All of us want Britishers to go from our country. So that means the nationalism feeling that we have inside. So their goal that all of us should come together and make our country or have our country free from the shackles of Britishers. Right? That was the main agenda. And then definitely we have a word again over here. Right? The association aimed the people. To have these sovereigns means we should be the supreme, we should be the ruling one, right? We should be the one who are there. We are the one who should be there at the top. In terms of country, we are speaking not the individuals, but our country should be there at the top. 
and that was the feeling they all had. Yes, nationalism is definitely good. Yes, Ankita. Okay, so once that happens, we realize the Britishers got scared. Oh my God, look at these people. Now they know why we came here, right? So Britishers realize that now these people are really very really smart. They have understood they are having those small, small formation of groups. And now what they are doing? They are actually attacking us. There are two ways of the attack, right everyone? One is of course with the weapon. We have the guns, right? And of course we are attack attacking the government at that particular time. The other way is of course with the words, right? So everyone, there are two ways, right? I'm sure you will be able to attack. Of course, first of course with the weapon and the second, the most powerful tool is with the words, with writing. So at that particular time when the British realized that Indians are getting the hold, right? So what they did? They did something really very bad for the people. So rising discontent was there. People were not very happy with the Britishers and then they started having the weapons. So there came the two act, the Arm Act and the Varnakir Press Act. Let's discuss about these. So according to the Arm Act, right, which was passed in the year 1878, no Indians can actually have a weapon, right? For example, at that particular time, if I want to go and get a weapon, I will not get a weapon. And just in case if I have, Britishers can actually take me to the jail. They can, they can arrest me easily, which was definitely, which was definitely not good thing, right? It was really very unfair. So this was an act which came in the year 1878. We will all remember this. 1858 when this act came and Indians cannot have the weapon. Then comes the second most important act all of us should know. The Vernacular Press Act means that we cannot express ourselves, right? It came also approximately the same time in 1878 and it suppressed. It suppressed that how we can express ourselves in the written and of course in the press. So, it allow the confiscation. Basically, if anyone is reading a newspaper which talks bad about Britishers, Britishers can arrest the person. Can arrest the person who is writing the article also. Right? So, this was again a very bad thing that had happened at that particular time. Britishers can easily arrest Indians. If they are reading something against Britishers, if they are writing against something, Britishers. So, everyone, are we clear? Two important acts. So I'll repeat it in Hindi for all of you. Jinnah nahi samajh maaya. Britishers ne do act banai. Ek act tha. Arm Act. 1878 maaya ke koi bhi Indians weapons nahi rak sakta. Or dousra act kya aaya? The Vernacular Press Act. Ki koi bhi insaan Britishers ke baare mein kuch bura nahi bol sakta. Kuch bura nahi lik sakta. Kuch bura nahi pad sakta. Bol to sakte hi haan. But usse press mein agar hum likhenge to they can arrest us. Agar hum o newspaper pad rahe hain. To bhi... हम लोग जेल जा सकते थे उस टाइम पे। Are we clear? Yes. Are we clear, everyone? Yes, yes, yes. Please make sure to give the thumbs up and you can write. Please ask your doubt. Yes. Awesome. Happy. Hi, Ishwar. Please write your doubt. Osma, please write your doubt. Mix bag. Very good. Gun gun. Yes. Yes. Narendra, Garima, Anjali. Okay. चलिए. Let's move ahead everyone. Korn Booth Rata bhi, right? Albert Act ke bhi, bill ke baare mein, right? We have it. Ankita, aapke paas mein, for example, if you're going in a school, right? The principal will tell you, oh, you should not be having mobile phones. Agar, mere, agar aapke paas mein mobile phone mila, to hum usse confiscate kar lenge. Basically, wo aapse le lenge. Cheen lenge wo aapse. Yes. Or if the newspaper content basically was talking bad about the Britishers, right? And if people will read, the people will become aware about what the Britishers are doing and they don't want that. Yes. We are clear with this, right? Awesome. So let's talk about this, everyone. We have the Elbert Bill, right? And over here we have. So in the 1883, this bill, bill actually allowed the trials of the Britishers or the Europeans people by Indian right so equality between the indian and the british judges in the india so for example if i am indian or if there is another britisher 
European person, Indians can actually take a trial, right? They can actually stand for them and they can talk about them. Against me, they can also talk. It was a good thing, right? But what happened? The white people opposed it. British, Britishers actually opposed it. No, Britishers case should be taken by the Britishers only and Indians should not be leading their cases. Clear? Yes. Everyone, are we clear with this? Very good. Yes. So, what had happened at that particular time? Definitely because of all of this drama that was happening, they actually take this law back, right? Of course, it was not very accepted by the Britishers. And they were like, mm, not so good, not so good. Clear everyone? Yes. So, it was reinstated and, and the desire for the Indian organization in the Indians, right? So, of course, but when this happened, there was a lot of racism also. Ki Indian people should not be fighting for the Britishers, right? So, here Indians say, nah, we want our own organization. And very simple, if we say, ke, kya hua tha yaha pe? Ek act aya, jisne bola ke na, ha, aap na allow the trials, aap Britishers ke aur Europeans loge trial le sakte ho. Thik hai, aap unke liye, agar koi bhi, agar koi bhi kisi insaan ne galat kiya hai, to you can actually be an against and can talk about it. Clear? Aap unke saath lad sakte ho, ye sab aap, achche se aap judge, aur us, पूरे सिस्टम में आप इन्वॉल्व हो सकते हो बट कुछ ब्रिटिशर्स को लगा कि अगर ऐसा हुआ तो गलत होगा सो दैट्स व्हाई देयर वाज लॉट ऑफ रेशियल एटीट्यूड्स ऑफ द ब्रिटिशर्स और वो इंडियंस को इतना पसंद नहीं करते थे उस टाइम पे क्लियर एवरीवन यस कम ऑन कम ऑन कम ऑन आई नो यस वी आर क्लियर विद दिस राइट एवरीवन यस वेरी गुड देवेश विल डिस्कस अबाउट इट one minute everyone, Achha, you want to take a screenshot? Previous slide, please take a screenshot of this everyone. Quickly take a screenshot. <clears throat> yes. They will, they want, we will discuss it. One minute, bache. And you can take a screenshot of this also. Archana. That means, ke, for example, we want to do something, right? For example, uh, let's suppose a very good example of this would be that, ke, you know that you are a deserving person, right? But someone will say, ke, you cannot do it. You want to come back over there, right? You will have more and more strong belief that you can definitely do it. It's kind of restoration. Vishwas ho gaya ke, British hamari baat nahi sunenge. To, jab yahan pe, unho ne aisa dekha ke, bohat zada racism hai. Whites have opposed it, so the Indians have realized that we need our own organization. Chahiye. We have to stand for ourselves. Clear? Yashika, white opposition over here means that white people have opposed it, British have opposed it. Yes. Clear? Screen is blurred. I am sure it's perfectly fine. Clear, right? Let's move ahead everyone. And let's take a look at the question that we have over here. Now such question can come in your examination. Let's see. Why were the people dissatisfied with the British rule in the 1870s and 1880? Why were Because of the rules? So let's see how you can frame your answer. Yes, you can increase your... Uh, yes, you can change the setting of your video. Yes, very good. Definitely, there were two laws which were passed. Act was passed that were not in a favor of Indians. That's why Indians were not supporting it, right? Secondly... The Elbit Bill controversy of 1883 was there, which contributed to the discontent. People are not ready to be, have belief in the Britishers now, right? It allowed the trials of Britishers or the European people by the Indians. It was, however, opposed by the white people, which exposed their racial attitude, right? And the, the bad thing that they think about the Indians. Are we clear? You can write it in your own words. Bilkul aap apne aap apne own words mein sakte ho. So in simple way, Britishers, right, Indians kyun khush nahi the Britishers se 1870 or 1880s mein, do, do reasons se. Ek to do act aay the, arm act aay tha, aur vernacular press act aay tha, jise loog khush nahi the, apne aap ko express nahi kar sakte the. Dousra jo law tha, ilbit bill controversy hui thi, ki ek taraf to wo loog bol rahe ki haan, aap, 
कोर्ट में आके ब्रिटिशर्स एंड यूरोपियन के अगेंस्ट ट्रायल कर सकते हो बट दूसरी तरफ ब्रिटिशर्स ही खुद बोल रहे हैं कि हमें ऐसे लोग पसंद नहीं है अगर वो आ भी रहे हैं तो बहुत ज्यादा बायसनेस हो रही है वहां पे उनकी बात सुनी नहीं जाएगी उनको राइट जस्टिस नहीं मिलेगा तो उस वजह से क्या हुआ इंडियंस को रियलाइज हुआ कि भाई हम तो सब कुछ कर रहे हैं हम तो अच्छे लोग बन के बैठे हैं पर हमारी कोई भी हेल्प नहीं कर रहा है राइट right? उस पॉइंट पे लोगों को रियलाइज होना स्टार्ट हुआ कि डन इज डन वी हैव टू फाइट फॉर आर सेल्स एवरी क्लियर है यहां तक जल्दी जल्दी सी वी आर टॉकिंग विद कोर्ट ऑर्डर 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 एवरी वन यस वी डू हैव मेन्टी टूडे पर आफ्टर वी आर डन लर्निंग ऑल ऑफ दिस क्लियर इट्स अ वेरी रिच चैप्टर एवरी वन तो थोड़ा सा हमें जल्दी पढ़ना होगा क्लियर है वेरी गुड ओके नो लेट्स टॉक अबाउट कि फिर लोगों को लगा कि लेट्स कम टूगेदर राइट एंड दैट्स हाउ वी हैव दर्मेशन ऑफ वी हैव दर्मेशन ऑफ इंडियन नेशनल कांग्रेस अभी क्लियर ईशा टू मार्क्स के लिए आ सकते हैं राइट दीज एक्ट कैन कम फॉर टू मार्क्स राइट ना लेट्स टॉक अबाउट एवरी वन दिस यू हैव टू रिमेंबर एट सच इंपॉर्टेंट कॉन्सेप्ट फॉर थ्री मार्क्स लॉन्ग क्वेश्चन जो होते हैं हमारे एग्जामिनेशन में it can come for that write about the indian national congress one big question describe about the indian national congress right it was established in the year 1885 ye thode se years hame yaad rakhne honge established in the year 1885 in mumbai very good sima history is my favorite subject also very good ankit uh, ankit i know yes yes to shu so early leadership pe what how, how many people were there so we have over here name दादा भाई नारोजी राइट वी हैव पेशराज मेहता राइट बहादुरेन तब्या जी देन वी हैव सुंदर नाथ बैनर्जी वी हैव एस सुब्रमण्यम अयर एवरी वन प्लीज मेक श्योर प्लीज मेक श्योर टू रिमेंबर द नेम ऑफ दीज ऑल इंडिविजुअल्स आर वी क्लियर यस ये बहुत जरूरी है आपका नाम याद रखना दे कैन आस्क यू दामिनेशन द मल्टीपल चॉइस क्वेश्चन ऑल्सो right and please make sure they can ask you to write about them da not directly right but maybe indirectly yes surendra nath yes sorry clear everyone so we have all of these names very important names of all the leaders yes okay so let's move ahead so what they do they by the efforts of nehru ji right what they did they actually they start mentoring the youth people they felt it ki if we can ignite the feeling right among the young indian the battle will or the freedom fight will become really very easy so of course they started monitoring the youth right and we have ao hume right he he united the indian from the various different region they started collecting people together please come together we all are brother and sister we all are working for our nation and that's how that's how we have this amazing organization formed and they came into the picture and they started helping people yes very good shubhi and darshan badhiya if you have learned everything but we will take some time right there are so many of us are here who are still learning and it's a very interesting chapter okay so we will make sure we have the learning and then we'll have the mentee yes thank you isha for sharing that information aditi Isha shared the full form. Very good. Hello, Dinesh. I know that you are new. Welcome to the class. Now, so this organization started having its demand. They started talking to the Britishers, and they're like, you know what? If you want to, if you want to be in our country, you be in our country, but you have to work accordingly. We have our association very close to our people. Let's listen to us, please, because we have our points. So what they did? They have the demands, right? and these demands are really very important first of course they in, they want to increase up presentation representation in the legislative council so they said ke you know what you have a council right we want to be a part of it it's very easy right for example if you are there in your school yes if you are there in your school and if you uh, for example if there is a election happening if you want to stand definitely you will go to your principal or your class teacher and you will talk right ke ma'am i want to stand clear yes so what the what the indian leaders at that time did they went and told ke see we want to be a part of the council so we want to stand in the election 
then they they want higher position of indians in the government they told kesi you are in our country give us the higher position and then of course they demanded a civil service examination so that indians can also be a part of it so initially they were all britishers but indian wanted to be in a part of it yes okay very good right everyone devansh so we have already discussed but someone who is really really in a higher position right superior ruler clear okay now let's understand how they reacted right how the britishers reacted first of all why why they want the indians to be there of course so that they can challenge the racism which is happening by the britishers if the indian people are at the authority we can definitely help our indian brothers and sisters right yes or no what do you think everyone that's a question ankita we will be asking ourselves yes everyone what do you think it's right right very good to reduce the drain to reduce the drain of wealth from the india to england so these demand also came they want us to have a separate country they want britishers to leave our country because of two reason of course there's a lot of racism which was happening second they want britishers to leave the wealth that we have they were like oh you have already taken so much from our country please do not take everything right yes very good very good everyone so based upon that right based upon that it happened and there are other demands also the other demands includes a separation of the the judiciary uh, from the executive right they want to repeal the um, arm effect unhone bola ki we have to revert back the arm act and freedom of speech and expression we should be able to express ourselves freely everyone are we clear yes g k p k yes take a screenshot of this everyone yes very good very good <clears throat> yes okay new right welcome to the class they want it happen in 18 uh, approximately is the same time we have it right 1885 diksha so indianism is nothing but of course we a sense of the indians right we want to have more indians in the system and we want britishers to leave our country because they have taken the wealth Yes, everyone, are we clear? Right? Quick thumbs up. NIC, Indian National Congress, right? We have just discussed it. Please, if you have missed it out, everyone, do take a screenshot of this. Indian National Congress. Clear? Very good. Here we have. Right, Charlie, everyone, let's move ahead. let's talk about the demands on the economic issues right on the economic issues so what were the demands of the people on the economic issues let's look at that yes so britishers rule tends to of course because they were ruling there were a lot of poverty right people have lo- they have very less money they were in the lot of debt right people have taken lo- loans but now they don't have the money to give it back and britishers are forcing them to give more tax they have to give the land also there are so many rules at that particular time so the demand of the indian national congress was to take back all those taxes back ease out the tax so that the people are now not burdened yes very simple thing right for example you just imagine a situation if you are at that particular time if you are that particular time right uh when of course the british are there of course you want to save the money and if you have less money you will not be able to give it to the government yes gillu please don't spam please don't spam the knows that you are asking us for class for for, the, for maths right and i think we already have those notes on the telegram channel yes very good and those of you who are saying bachcha i am not ignoring any one of you that just that so many of you are here so it's very difficult for me to look at all the uh, all the you know chats right are we clear up to here right 
सर हिंदी में बताती हूँ आप लोग बार बार बोल रहे हो हिंदी में सो इंडियन नेशनल कांग्रेस ने क्या बोला इंडियन नेशनल कांग्रेस ने बोला कि आपकी हमारे वी हैव सम डिमांड्स राइट हमारे पास में कुछ डिमांड्स हैं हमें क्या चाहिए हमें ज्यादा लोग चाहिए असेंबली में हम चाहते हैं हमारे लोग असेंबली में रहें हमारे लोग ज्यादा इंडियन गवर्नमेंट जो इंडियंस है वो गवर्नमेंट का पार्ट बने और हमारे लिए सिविल एग्जामिनेशन हो ताकि हम लोग भी लॉज को बनाने में हेल्प कर पाए और क्या डिमांड थी इंडियन नेशनल कांग्रेस की के ये सब डिमांड इसलिए आए क्योंकि उन्हें लग रहा था कि इंडिया के इंडियंस की स्पेशली इंडियंस की तरफ बहुत ज्यादा रेसिज्म था पार्शलिटी होती थी इंडियंस के प्रति तो उनको लगा कि अगर इंडियंस हायर पोजीशन पे होंगे तो वो बाकी इंडियंस की हेल्प कर पाएंगे तो फर्स्ट ये हो गया कि रेसिज्म की वजह से उन्होंने डिमांड्स मांगी सेकंड पॉइंट उनको लग रहा था कि इंडिया में सारी वेल्थ चली जाएगी ब्रिटिशर्स लेके चले जाएंगे दैट्स व्हाई दे वांट द इंडियंस टू बी एट द पावर वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट पॉइंट उन्होंने बोला कि हमें अलग से सिस्टम चाहिए इंडियंस के लिए और हमें अपने लोग चाहिए सिस्टम में ताकि हम लोग इजिली रूल कर पाए दैट्स वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट और उन्होंने बोला कि आप आम एक्ट वापस ले लो हमें फ्रीडम ऑफ स्पीच और फ्रीडम फ्रीडम ऑफ एक्सप्रेशन भी मिलना चाहिए इकोनॉमिक इश्यूज में व्हाट वर देयर डिमांड के देयर डिमांड्स के रिडक्शन कर दो रेवेन्यू पे टैक्स कम कर दीजिए रिडक्शन ऑफ मिलिट्री एक्सपेंडिचर आप जो हमसे पैसा ले रहे हो मिलिट्री के लिए वो मत लो राइट एंड इंक्रीज अ फंड फॉर इरीगेशन आप लोग ही हमें पैसा दो इरीगेशन के लिए क्योंकि हमारे पास में पैसे नहीं है तो उन्होंने ये भी बोला कि हमें हमें बहुत सारे जो अननेसेसरी टैक्सेस लगे हैं वो हमसे हटा लो राइट एवरी वन आर वी क्लियर यस अनुश्री यू आर आसिंग समथिंग डिस्कसिंग इन अट देवांश प्लीज डोंट स्पैम यू ओनली टेल मी द आंसर सी एक देवांश ने क्वेश्चन पूछा एक देवांश ने आंसर दिया एवरी वन वी हैव ऑलरेडी डिस्कस इट टू प्लीज हेल्प यूर फ्रेंड्स आउट इन द चैट राइट एंड लेट स्टे फोकस एवरी वन आई कैन सी मेनी ऑफ यू टॉकिंग हेयर एंड देर यू आर You know your time is really very precious. I don't want you to waste your time. Yes, very good. Thank you, Anushree, for helping your friends out here. Yes, they were demanding for the, they were demanding for the justice and for the rights. Okay, so let's take a question, everyone. Here we have. Now, what do you think? Which of the following is not a demand put forward by NIC in the front of British? Read the question carefully. Right, read the question carefully, everyone. So, what we have over here? Yes. In which the country demand actually Britishers, Indian Cong, Indian National Congress, and नहीं रखी थी Britishers के सामने. Very easy, right? It's a very easy question. I'm sure you'll be able to find the answer for this. Very good, very good, everyone. Yes, option number C is absolutely correct. So they don't want to increase the military kharcha, right? They don't want to increase the military expenditure. They want to decrease it, right? Very good. Yes, NIC is Indian National Congress. Okay, everyone. So are we clear up to here, right? We are clear up to here. Let's talk about something very important. Right now, at that particular time, at that particular time, when all of this was happening, Indians were definitely rising high, and we have parties formation. We have so many freedom fighters, right? Yes. So what happened over there? Then of course we have different sets of people. Now let's discuss about it, everyone. Right? We have two different sets of people. Okay. What was option number D? हाँ ये नहीं था ना. Reduction of revenue मांगा था. Reduction on the tax मांगा था. Yes. Okay. Yes. 
Very good. Yes. Now we'll be discussing about the moderate and the radicals, right? So who are the moderates and the radicals? Let's understand this, everyone. So there are two sets of people, right? I'm, I'm sure nowadays also we refer to this particular word. There are moderate people and there are radical people. So the moderate are the one, right? Basically, they are the one who will talk very softly to the people. They are the one who will file in petition. They are the one who will be speaking, right? So the moderate aims to bring the awareness about the injustice that is happening by the British rule. They were the one who give speech, publish their newspaper, wrote articles. They believe that the Britishers will respect their ideas and will leave. Do you think that this is a reality? Right, tell me. Anushri, please stop swimming, I'll tell you. We have already discussed that part. I will tell you, but you need to wait Bachche, for some time. Yes, everyone? Ankit, I didn't get score-based question. I'm just telling you if the question is important. Yes. Right? So we have the moderators now. Moderate, right? They are the moderate and they are the people who will be talking to the people, spreading awareness. They believe in the idea. They believe in the idea of non-violence, right? They are the one who said it, okay, we should not be harming the others. If our ideas are correct, Britishers will be able to understand them and they will respect their ideas and they will leave our country. Clear? Petition means, Shreya, like we will be signing petitions, right? We will say, Kacha, you want, uh, you want the votes, right? If you, if you want something to happen, let's collect 1000 people who have the same point. Okay? Yes, very good. Prasad, we have already had those notes on Telegram, you can watch there. Clear? Yes, everyone, are we clear? Yes. So are we clear with this, right? Remember these names. All of these names that we have over here, right? Dadabai Naroji, right? We have Gopal Krishna Golkhe, right? We have Sundar, uh, Surendra Nath Banerjee. All of these were the moderate, right? Moderate, they believe in the idea that, you know, if with calmness, if we tackle Britishers, they'll be able to understand our views. Opposite to them, we have the radicals, right? Now, of course, they are the one who will be criticizing the moderates, right? Because they feel it came, you know why? They feel it came, even though we are trying our best, Britishers are not understanding. Yes, Britishers are not understanding and they are not giving us our right. So, in the 1890s, they started criti cr criticizing them and of course, we have radical leaders emerging. We have Lala Lajpat Rai, I am sure you have heard about him. You have heard about Bal Gangadhar Tilak and Bipin Chandrapal, right? They argued, they said that, that we cannot sit and we will not get the freedom. We have to take some actions, right? We have to take some actions to get our independence. And that's how we have the radicals, right? They are the one, they are the one who argued with the belief that good intention will not be helping Britishers to move away from our country. And because of that, the people, they said that people should start the fight for Swaraj. Right, everyone? Are we clear with this? Lal, Bal and Pal, absolutely. You can take a screenshot. Yes, you can take a screenshot of this. Very good, very good everyone. <clears throat> yes, are we clear? Yes, are we clear with this, right? Ha. Huh. So, NIC, I think people still have some doubt about NIC. So, NIC, I'll just move away. Uh, please do take a screenshot of this also and here also. Yes, take a screenshot of this. So NIC of course is Indian National Congress, founder of course was A.O. Hume, right? Then the first, the first, first, first president of the NIC uh, in the year 1885 was Vomesh Chandra Banerjee, right? Very good. 
Clear? Yes. Okay. No, uh, no, Adiva, they didn't support the Britishers. They are the one who said that we should not wait for them to leave the country. We should kick them out of the country. Swaraj means freedom, yes. Third point. But the third point ka matlab yahan pe ye hai. Uh, they believe that ke if, if we will tell the Britishers that no, our intentions are good, please leave our country, they will not listen. We have to show the fight. Santosh, that means ke, that means basically, uh, that means that no, uh, basically a people who are self-dependent. Yes. Very good. Right, everyone, are we clear with this? Are we clear with this? Tell me, I hope that all of you have taken a, a screenshot of this. Yes, very good everyone. Okay, Charlie, let's move ahead and let's talk about furthermore, right, what happened unfortunately we saw a partition of Bengal in the 1905. So as of course the independent, right, independence become, was becoming more and more a common word in the household. Freedom was becoming more and more common in the household. The rebel was increasing. Britishers at one point felt it that they cannot control the Indians now. So at that particular time, we saw some very unfortunate thing happening. And that was the partition of Bengal. And that happened in the year 1905. So what happened in there? Let's understand. Yes. Very good. Very good. So what we saw that in the 1905, we see that the Bengal, India, right? It was the British biggest part. It was the biggest part, right? Yes, it was the biggest part that we have over there. Now, what happened? It, it included the parts of Bihar, it included the parts of Orissa, right? It, it included the Assam, the current Assam that we have on the northeast part. And a little bit ahead of that. So what they did, they actually separated it, right? And they actually removed the non-Bengal area. So what they did, they separated the East Bengal, right? And they separated the Assam, stating that we need our only Bengal speaking people in one particular region. Right? That's what had happened over there. Yes. Devansh Sharma, you are not correct. Devansh Vardhan. Yes, WC Banerjee was the first president. Devansh Sharma, no, Vachit. There was some confusion I think you had. But now you know the correct answer, right? Yes. Are we clear, everyone? Ma'am, whose idea was more supported by the people, moderate and the radical? So, Shelly, it was both, right? We will see that it was both. Clear, right? Creative diary, is that a bache? So, that means so, the word that you're asking, sovereignty means basically a supreme power. Yes, a little bit, but welcome. Okay. Are we clear, everyone? So, we saw the partition of Bengal, right? Over here. Then why the partition was happening and who was behind this partition? Let's take a look now. Yes. So here we have the partition of Bengal happening in the year 1905. And the person who was responsible for it is the Viceroy Lord Curzon. Right over here? Curzon. Clear? Curzon we can say. Right? And of course he was the one who said that Okay, because we are not able to manage these people, right? Because it's such a big part, we are not able to manage that particular, we have difficulties in the administration, we should divide them. Are we clear? Yes. So because of that only, we saw the partition of Bengal happening. This was a partition, right? Definitely it was good in interest for the Britishers and for the businessmen in mind. And that will be... Once you're breaking apart, right, people will not be very happy about it. That will disturb the movement of independence and Britishers have more advantage. Clear? So, it's very simple. If we see partition of Bengal, why did it happen? Because Britishers thought that you are coming to India, we have to divide them all together. 
सो उन्होंने ये बोला कि हमें संभालने में लोगों को बहुत दिक्कत होती है क्योंकि काफी बड़ा एरिया है हम इसे दो पार्ट में डिवाइड कर देते हैं एक वो पार्ट रहेगा ईस्ट बंगाल जहां पे बंगाल स्पीकिंग लोग हैं बाकी पार्ट में वो लोग रहेंगे जो बंगाली नहीं बोलते हैं अफकोर्स ब्रिटिशर का खुद का फायदा था अपने बिजनेस के लिए अपने फायदे के लिए ताकि इंडियन लोग इन्वॉल्व ना रहे इन अ फाइट ऑफ इंडिपेंडेंस दे डिवाइडेड दी वेस्ट बेसिकली दे डिवाइडेड दी बंगाल राइट श्रेया ही वाज अ पर्सन हु वाज रिस्पांसिबल फॉर द डिवीजन ऑफ बंगाल इट्स ओवर हियर देखो यहां पे स्क्रीन पे देखो यस आर वी क्लियर स्वराज मींस सेल्फ रूल यस फ्रीडम हम अपना राज खुद कर सकते हैं स्वराज सेल्फ रूल क्लियर Yes, very good. IB, you can go on नाइन्थ and टेंथ channel और आपको मिल जाएगा Yes. Mishra will discuss about it. Radicals and extreme. वो अभी पढ़ते हैं उनके बारे में Sometime. Yes. Clear everyone. जल्दी से How many of you are here? Yes. चलिए We have a long way to go, everyone. We have to finish this class. Jaldi se. We have Menti also. But yeah, I don't have IB. I don't have those notes. You have to check on ninth and tenth channel. Okay. Super clear, Anna. Kitne likes aa gaye hain? Jaldi se. Please make sure everyone hit the like button. Hit the like button, everyone. Yes. Very good. Very good, everyone. We need more likes, right? मतलब बहुत सारे बच्चे हैं, I'm sure. This is a small break for all of us. Yes. आज मेंटी है. We have the मेंटी पर क्लास के बाद. Everyone, let's have eighty likes. जल्दी से. A break for all of you and a break break for me. I'm just drinking water. हाँ. भरिया एंड जो बच्चे इफ यूर न्यू हेयर राइट इफ यूर न्यू हेयर एंड इफ यू फील दैट द क्लास इज गोइंग अमेजिंगली वेल समझ में आ रहा है प्लीज मेक श्योर टू हिट द लाइक बटन एंड सब्सक्राइब टू द चैनल चलिए सो वी आर क्लियर विद दिस राइट यस ओके नाउ लेट्स टॉक अबाउट एवरी वन वॉट हैपन आफ्टर दी पार्टिशन ऑफ बंगाल Right till now we have we are clear that what happened till now right Bengal का partition हो गया है right of course we have two different groups all together now who are fighting for the freedom let's see के क्या हुआ after the separation or the partition of the Bengal so a lot of people opposed right all the people be the moderates and the radical opposed this decision of the Britishers they were like भाई हमारे India को क्यों divide कर रहे हो Right. Good evening, everyone. Those of you joining us right now. So, Neil, note your point. We will be. Yes. I can't understand your your name, but welcome to the class. Yes. So, of course, organization of large public meeting and demonstration happens. Right. People came together to discuss more about it. People are like, "Nay, ye sab nahi chalega hamare country mein. We don't want to get divided." And thirdly, we saw the initiation of the Swadeshi movement. So these are the three marks question that can come. What happened after the separation or the partition? You can write these three points. Just write these three points. You will get your marks. Okay. Any points? Go. Thoda sa elaborate kar sakte. If you want to write one or two more lines, and you will have your points with you. Clear? Yes. Right, everyone. I hope that this is clear to each one of you. Okay. So this is also very important. Partition of Bengal के बारे में भी आपको पूरा लिखने को आ सकता है. लेकिन आज की जो write about five marks question, write about the part, write describe about the partition of India. Sorry, partition of Bengal, not India. Sorry, partition of Bengal. Yes. So हमने ये देखा कि 1905 में हमने देखा इंडिया में partition हुआ बंगाल का. Britishers ने ये बोला कि उनको रूल करने में दिक्कत हो रही है इसलिए पार्टीशन करना जरूरी है और उन्होंने वेस्ट बंगाल ईस्ट बंगाल 
और बेसिकली वेस्ट बंगाल को दो पार्ट में काटा राइट उन्होंने बोला कि जहां पे लोग बंगाली बोल रहे हैं वो एक एरिया हो गया इंस्टेड ऑफ रिमूविंग दी बंगाल नॉन बंगाल एरिया उन्होंने मर्ज कहीं गए पे मर्ज किया कहीं गए पे सेपरेट आउट कर दिया और फिर उन्होंने बोला कि बस ये हम इसलिए करें ताकि हम इजिली रूल कर पाए मैनेज कर पाए और ऑफकोर्स इनका प्रॉफिट था और ऑफकोर्स इंडियंस को अच्छा नहीं लगा अभी क्लियर अनुश्री आई कैन सी दैट वर्ड यू आर आस्किंग मी आई वुड लव टू टॉक अबाउट दिस बट अभी नहीं राइट right? we will have an open end discussion where we will discuss about our ideologies right but in this class we will not be able to discuss right we are focusing on the history hum yahan pe zyada contribute nahi kar sakte what is there is there we all individuals have a mindset and i encourage all of us to have a proper mindset right but whatever is, is over here here we right aage dekhte hain clear Thumbs up everyone. Are we clear up to here? चलिए आ वी क्लियर लेट्स टॉक अबाउट दी द स्वदेशी मूवमेंट एंड दिस इज सुपर इंपॉर्टेंट राइट सुपर सुपर इंपॉर्टेंट एवरी वन आई मेकिंग लॉट ऑफ स्टार ओवर हेयर बहुत क्रूशल है फ्रॉम द एग्जाम पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू यस द स्वदेशी मूवमेंट वॉज समथिंग टू मेक पीपल अवेयर अबाउट to enlist to add the feeling of one nation so desi cheeze pehno khadi pehno don't uh, buy the english goods right all of these things came at that particular time right so desi movement pe it encourage the people to use the swadeshi good made in india we are back to the same track now right then national education do not study in the english institution study it indian indi indian school use indian products work for the indian people if you have a job in the britishers government leave that job if you are a lawyer in the court leave that job and come out and support indians so yahan se kya hua this was the stand against the britishers ke we will not be supporting you right we will not be supporting you we will not be using any of your products and that this particular movement actually stayed for a very long time bring it brought it actually brought the people together and this actually we saw that mass boycott of the inst indian good uh, sorry britishers goods and their institution i'm sure in the movies if you have seen right there will be burning the clothes boycott deeply means will not be using something for example let's suppose you say like okay i'll not be buying this you are completely boycotting it right you are just disowning that thing very good so everyone are we clear yes are we clear with this very good so so, so swadeshi movement pe humne kya samjha so so, so swadeshi movement ho raha tha right and uh, swadeshi movement mein logo ko bola gaya aur logo ke with the feeling ki hum kuch bhi britishers ka use jo bhi britishers goods ban rahe hain उनके इंस्टीट्यूशन है हम कुछ भी चीज उनकी यूज नहीं करेंगे वी विल बी डिसोनिंग राइट हम उनको हटा देंगे अपनी लाइफ से हम उन्हें बाइकआउट कर देंगे ब्रिटिशर्स गुड उनके इंस्टीट्यूशन उनके जॉब्स और हम सिर्फ स्वदेशी चीजें लेंगे मेड इन इंडिया चीजें लेंगे आ वी क्लियर एवरी वन ये आवी क्लियर वेरी गुड yes very good very good okay so we are clear with this right awesome everyone so let's get it started ahead i please take a screenshot yes ankita sahani but of course right they were not they just said ki let's not use the product they were not concerned about that particular time about the growth of the global views right they were more concerned about the freedom and uh, shreya boycott means bachche is cheez ka pura bahishkar kar deta disowning that 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 particular thing utkarsh abhi aapko hindi mein samjhaya hai lalita abhi hindi mein samjhaya tha beta yes chaliye so everything i hope that this is clear very good very good <coughs> 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 uh, 
yes. Got it right? So, जैसे ही जैसे ही पार्टिशन हुआ बंगाल का इन 1905 उसके बाद में हमने देखा कि स्वदेशी मूवमेंट स्टार्ट हो गया क्लियर ओके नाउ लेट्स टॉक अबाउट द पॉलिटिकल डेवलपमेंट दैट वी सॉ एट दैट पर्टिकुलर टाइम राइट क्या क्या पॉलिटिकल डेवलपमेंट वर हैपनिंग एट दैट पर्टिकुलर टाइम सो इन 1904 in 1906 वी हैव द फॉर्मेशन ऑफ द मुस्लिम लीग राइट so muslim people right the population came together and they have their own league which is the muslim league a small party or the association which was formed right then of course it happened in the dhaka by a group of the muslims uh, nawabs and the lords right and they came together and of course they want to have it right they have their own association yes yes senia it was they supported the partition of bengal and demanded a separate electorate basically they want ठीक है कि सेपरेशन हो गया दैट्स गुड वेल एंड गुड एंड दे आल्सो वांट देयर पोजीशन इन दी काउंसिल दे सेड दैट दैट वी शुड आल्सो हैव अ प्लेस इन दी काउंसिल एंड वी आल्सो वांट टू स्टैंड इन दी इलेक्शन देन ऑफ कोर्स देयर डिमांड्स मेट इन द 1909 एंड ऑफ कोर्स फ्यू सीट्स ऑफ द काउंसिल वर रिजर्व फॉर मुस्लिम पीपल आर वी क्लियर राइट सो देयर वाज अ डिमांड एंड दैट हैपेंड सो दिस इज अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट ईयर 1906 में मुस्लिम लीग फॉर्म ए फॉर्म हुई ढाका में राइट right? उन्होंने बोला कि हमें इलेक्शंस पे खड़े रहना है और 1909 में उनके लिए सीट रिजर्व हो गई अभी क्लियर शैली इट मींस कि उन्हें भी वोट्स चाहिए उन्हें भी इलेक्शन में खड़ा होना है एशर एम की क्लास डिले नहीं हुई है द क्लास विल स्टार्ट एट एट थर्टी यस उनको इसलिए उन्होंने सपोर्ट करा उन्होंने इसलिए सपोर्ट करा डिविजन उनको लगा कि ठीक है डिविजन से एटलीस्ट एक 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 कम्युनिटी के पीपल एक तरफ है यस प्लीज कुमार डाउट सुपर सुपर क्लियर मेंटी है बट लेट्स सी वी फर्स्ट वी हैव टू फिनिश दिस चैप्टर ओके नाउ लेट्स सी वॉट आर दी अदर पॉलिटिकल डेवलपमेंट एवरीवन फर्स्ट इंपॉर्टेंट 1907 में क्या हुआ कांग्रेस स्प्लिट हो गई अब मॉडरेटर्स मॉडरेट एंड उसके अंदर ही पार्टी के अंदर ही लोगों ने लड़ाई शुरू कर दी राइट दे लाइक अरे साथ में हम नहीं चल पाएंगे सो इन 1907 जीरो सेवन द कांग्रेस स्प्लिट एंड दी डोमिनेशन ऑफ दी मॉडरेट ऑफकोर्स यहां पे कुछ ऊपर नीचे हम देखोगे मिला मॉडरेट से बोला कि अच्छा हमारे अपने एक अलग प्रिंसिपल हैं, वी विल वर्क ऑन दैट रेडिकल्स कुछ और बोल रहे थे और कुछ लोगों को अलग ही सेंस चल रहा था कि दे आर नॉट श्योर के विच पार्टी दे शुड सपोर्ट और विच आइडियोलॉजी दे शुड सपोर्ट तो वी वी सॉ द स्प्लिट इन नाइनटीन ये दोनों फिर से वापस आ गए moderates and radicals came together again so that they can work together for the independence of the country yes pushpa the split was ki ideas match nahi ho rahe the right the ideas was not getting matched unko laga ki let's work separately on different ideas apne logon se ladai karte rahenge to india ko freedom kab dilayenge right that's why they thought to have the split in the party 1916 mein signing of the lucknow pact I think starting the you are asking about this right few of you are asking about the lucknow pact so in 1916 lucknow pact was signed between the congress and the muslim league can you tell me why the muslim sorry why this pact was signed yes clear quickly everyone yes what was in, what what was the lucknow pact jaldi se batao <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> yes, everyone, tell me what was Lucknow Pact. To unite, very good. See, very easy. Eh? So in the Lucknow Pact, right? When we look over here, we have two important things: the Congress and the Muslim League. So the main idea, the main idea for signing that Muslim, uh, this Lucknow Pact, was to unite the people, right? Unite the Hindus and the Muslims, and to work together for the nation, right? And two parties साथ में आए उन्होंने बोला कि हम अपनी religious को और अपने language को साथ में लेके चलेंगे, पर उसके लिए दंगे नहीं होंगे, उसके जैसे हमारे बीच में differences नहीं होंगे. We will be working for the same 
नोशन एक ही चीज के लिए हम सब काम करेंगे अभी क्लियर यस हिंदी में समझाया इंग्लिश में समझाया होप दैट ईच वन ऑफ यू आर क्लियर दिस इज अ टू मार्क्स क्वेश्चन एवरी वन एंड दिस इज सुपर इंपॉर्टेंट लखनऊ पैक्ट में क्या हुआ था यस क्रिएटिव डायरीज कुछ नहीं बचे नाइनटीन जीरो सेवन में कांग्रेस स्प्लिट हुई थी कोई एक्ट नहीं है स्प्लिट हुई थी हर्षा वॉट इज अ डाउट जयश्री कुड बी अरे गुनगुन क्या बातें चल रही है यस गॉट इट वेरी गुड क्रिएटिव डायरीज यस दीप्ति सो so, अगर हम बोलेंगे कि क्या हो रहा था यस वॉट वॉज हैपनिंग ओवर देयर लखनऊ पैक्ट में उन्होंने ये बोला कि इंडियन और जो 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 कांग्रेस और मुस्लिम लीग ने क्या बोला कि हम हिंदू को और मुस्लिम्स को साथ में लेके चलेंगे हम पूरी कोशिश करेंगे कि लैंग्वेज और रिलीजन की वजह से कोई भी डिफरेंसेस ना आ पाए और हम अब इक्वली एक दूसरे को इक्वल इंपॉर्टेंस देंगे और अपनी कंट्री की इंडिपेंडेंस के लिए फाइट करेंगे क्लियर दीप्ति Yes, very good, everyone. Okay, let's move ahead. Now, let's see what happened in the year nineteen ninety. Now, this is super important, everyone. Now, India me, बहुत कुछ चल रहा है. So, ऐसी movement चल रहा है, right? लोग, लोग, मतलब लोगों के बीच में एक sense आ गया है for the independence. In nineteen ninety, we see some of the incident happening. Let's look at that, right? So, freedom. स्ट्रगल स्टार्ट हो गया फ्रीडम फाइट फाइट स्टार्ट हो गई अलग अलग पार्ट ऑफ द कंट्रीज में 1920s में हमने क्या देखा कांग्रेस बहुत एक्टिव हो गई है राइट दे आर वेरी एक्टिव और इसी के टाइम पे वी सॉ द फर्स्ट वर्ल्ड वॉर कैन यू टेल मी फर्स्ट वर्ल्ड वॉर कब से कब तक स्टार्ट हुआ था कब से कब तक चला था जल्दी से फर्स्ट वर्ल्ड वॉर एवरी वन वेन इट स्टार्ट एंड इट एंड एट वॉट इन विच य स्वदेशी so, मूवमेंट किसने स्टार्ट किया था थिंक अबाउट इट वी हैव टू क्वेश्चन ऑन सेम थिंग वेरी गुड 1914 एंड 1918. सो द फर्स्ट वर्ल्ड वॉर स्टार्टेड इन द ईयर 1914, राइट एंड इट एंडेड इन द ईयर 1918. वेरी गुड 14 टू 18, राइट दैट वॉज द ड्यूरेशन ऑफ द वर्ल्ड वॉर फर्स्ट During the World War First, right? During the First World War, Britishers got involved in the war, and at that particular time, Indians got time to establish themselves, right? Very good, Mahatma Gandhi. Very good. So those of you who are asking about the question, I'm sure you have the answer now. Very good. Yes, Mahatma Gandhi. Yes. So हमें हमें हमने now we have the clarity that during the First World War. What happened? Britishers got busy with their war, and at that particular time, they asked Indians to join the armies. They asked more tax, right? And somehow we were supporting them. Lalita, it's Tanvi. You are uh, the answer is Mahatma Gandhi. Yes, clear. Clear, everyone. So are we clear up to here that what happened till the First World War? क्रिएटिव डायरीज अभी बताया बच्चे आपको यस वेरी गुड राइट सर यू क्लियर अप टू हेव ओके सो लेट्स सी एवरीवन वन फर्स्ट वर्ल्ड वॉर में क्या हो रहा था सो so, हमें पता है कि फर्स्ट वर्ल्ड वॉर स्टार्ट हुई और अब बिजनेस वाले जो लोग थे वो क्या सपोर्ट कर रहे थे व्हाट वॉर देयर कंडीशन राइट and let's understand what was happening at that particular time in the common india normal india mein kya chal raha tha yes so let's talk about that so we know that first world war has impacted india yes they impacted the indian population even though the first world wars were happening not with the india right india was not directly involved in the war but definitely we know that as the britishers were ruling our country we are bound to support them in some way or the other so india at that particular time gave them the soldiers 
provided more money to them they actually uh, gave them money so that they can survive in the war yes anushree the indians were, don't have a choice right they were ruling our country so of course they they asked our indian people to join the army after means i didn't get your question please can you rephrase it again our answer rephrase it again and please then um, ask, ask the question so first of course we say that rise in the defense expenditure so what happens as the world war came right what we saw we saw that they asked the indians to give us the money and because there was a rise in the defense expenditure right ab army mein paise lagane pad rahe hain machines banwani padi thi hame unko weapons chahiye the uske liye they asked they actually increase the defense expenditure aur paise chahiye the unko war mein participate karne ke liye they increase the tax and the income and the profit so they in, they increase the tax on the people of a country then of course we saw the sharp rise in the prices right we saw sharp rise in the prices and a lot of inflammation was happening clear so prices cheezon ke badh rahe the mehngai bahut zyada ho rahi thi us time pe country mein and they were forcing indian people to join the army are we clear yes please ask your doubt i'll explain it again so now hum kya baat kar rahe hain hum baat kar rahe hain world war first ki aur kaise impact kiya usne india ko aur india ki independence ko तो so, हमें पता है कि ब्रिटिशर्स उस टाइम पे रूल कर रहे थे उन्होंने क्या बोला आपको अब हमें ज्यादा पैसे देने पड़ेंगे हम टैक्स बढ़ाएंगे ताकि हम अपनी आर्मी को वेपन्स दे पाए राइट थर्ड इंपॉर्टेंट पॉइंट उन्होंने क्या बोला कि अब आपको फोर्सफुली हम आर्मी भी ज्वाइन करनी होगी यू हैव टू ज्वाइन दी आर्मी बिकॉज उन्हें सोल्जर्स चाहिए थे थर्ड एंड फोर्थ मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट पॉइंट दैट वी है जब वर्ल्ड वॉर चल रही थी तो चीजें महंगी हो गई राइट right? चीजों का प्राइस बढ़ गया जो गुड शायद से पहले थोड़े से कम पैसों में मिलते होंगे अब उनके प्राइजेस बढ़ गए जिनके पास में पैसे नहीं हैं, वो लोग और ज्यादा गरीब होते गए राइट और जिनके पास से पैसे हैं, वो संभाव मैनेज कर रहे थे क्लियर एवरीवन? यस आवी क्लियर वेरी गुड वेरी गुड एवरी यू कैन टेक अ स्क्रीन ऑफ दिस Yes, चलिए right? अंकिता ऐसा कुछ डील तो नहीं था बट इंडियन स्पेल्ट की अगर हम उनका मदद करेंगे तो शायद से वो हमारी कंट्री से चले जाएंगे हाय स्नेहा सो वॉर थी ऑफकोर्स वी द वॉर वॉज बिटवीन टू डिफरेंट ऑल सेट ऑफ नेशन राइट एक तो ऑपोजिट में जर्मनी फॉर श्योर sure था राइट ऑफ कोर्स फिर उसके साथ में इन दी ऑपोजिट वी हैव इंग्लैंड फ्रांस क्लियर यस अनुश्री दो ज्यादा पीपल हु बिलीव कि मिलिट्री से हम लोग सबको कंट्रोल कर सकते हैं नहीं नहीं इमाद नहीं नॉट डायरेक्टली यस वेरी गुड चलिए लेट्स मूव हियर एवरीवन अब हमें क्या हुआ राइजिंग कॉन्शियस के बारे में बात करेंगे गरिमा इसका मतलब कि भर्ती करवाना है लोगों को आदमित प्लीज आस्क यू डाउट यस शैली दे वर फोर्स टू ज्वाइन दी वॉर सो फोर्स रिक्वेटमेंट वॉज हैपनिंग राइट उनको बोला जा रहा जबरदस्ती उनको लेके जा रहे थे डिफेंस सर्विसेस में राइट right? क्योंकि उनके पास कोई ऑप्शन तो उन्हें सोल्जर्स चाहिए सो दे वॉज फोर्सिंग पीपल टू ज्वाइन दी आर्मी यस यस अंकित ऑफकोर्स प्रिया इसका मतलब भर्ती करवाना दे वर फोर्स टू ज्वाइन ओके एंड दे वर्क अबाउट बेसिकली वॉट दे डेड एट दैट पर्टिकुलर टाइम दे एक्सप्लॉइटेड द पीपल ऑफ इंडिया एंड एफ्रीका राइट by using the imperialist power by their military power right imar those are the people you are asking about the imperialist government right those means basically that a meaning that we have over here is that they are the one who believe in the army rule forcefully rule ki army se logon ko dara ke hum kaam karwa sakte hain clear so 
ब्रिटिशर्स ने फोर्स किया नॉट जस्ट एशिया के लोगों को बट अफ्रीका के लोगों को ऑल्सो क्योंकि वहां पे तब वो रूल कर रहे थे जबरदस्ती उन्हें बोला कि आपको आर्मी ज्वाइन करनी पड़ेगी अद्वित इसका मतलब है कि वो लोगों ने फोर्सफुली ज्वाइन करने के लिए बोल रहे थे आर्मी उनकी भर्ती करवा दी क्लियर फिर इंडियन नेशनलिस्ट टेकिंग इंस्पिरेशन फ्रॉम द रशियन रेवल्यूशन इन दी 1970 अब इंडियंस को लगा कि नहीं हमें भी कुछ करना चाहिए और इंडिया के अंदर भी वो विद्रोह की भावना आ गई दैट वॉज देयर इन दी रशियन रेवल्यूशन क्लियर सो ये बहुत ही छोटा सा इंपॉर्टेंट सेगमेंट है इंपॉर्टेंट ये है आप लोगों के लिए ऑल ऑफ यू प्लीज मेक श्योर यू यू रिमेंबर ऑल ऑफ दीज पॉइंट कि हाउ इंडिया हैड एन इम्पैक्ट ऑफ दी वर्ल्ड वॉर फर्स्ट क्लियर यस चलो लेट्स टेक अ लुक एट दिस पर्टिकुलर क्वेश्चन एवरी वन क्वेश्चन इज विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग इवेंट विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग इवेंट इज क्रोनोलॉजिकली इन करेक्ट ऑर्डर में हमें रखना है कि कब कौन सा पहले हुआ था क्या हुआ था राइट देन प्लीज राइट प्लीज पिक कि इसमें से कौन सा इन करेक्ट है 1905 में पार्टीशन ऑफ बंगाल हुआ फॉर्मेशन ऑफ मुस्लिम लीग हुई 1906 में 1907 में कांग्रेस का स्प्लिट हुआ और 1915 में साइनिंग ऑफ लखनऊ पैक्ट क्या गलत है इसमें से अभी पढ़ा राइट लखनऊ पैक्ट वॉज साइन इन 19 सी ओवे हो 1916 राइट right? 1916 में लखनऊ पैक्ट साइन हुआ था सो ऑप्शन नंबर डी इज द इनकरेक्ट वन क्लियर आर वी क्लियर एवरी वन विथ दिस यस इमार वी नेवर नो इन द हिस्ट्री राइट चलिए ओके सो आर वी क्लियर अप टू हेयर एवरी वन Now I really want to actually ask you people because there are quite a bit. I know that अभी भी हमारे पास में बहुत कुछ है पढ़ने के लिए So I think I'll not will not be able to finish our class right properly. So I'm thinking of having a second part of this particular class, right? We will join these classes together, but I don't think we'll be able to finish in today's class. It's a very lengthy chapter, and as of now we have just finished the half. राइट सिर्फ हाफ ही करा है बिकॉज इट्स अ वेरी बिग चैप्टर आई वॉन्ट यू टू अंडरस्टैंड इट प्रॉपरली राइट सो एवरी वन लेट्स हैव पार्ट टू राइट सो आई विल बी लेटिंग यू नो वेन विल बी हैविंग द पार्ट टू इफ नॉट इन दिस वीक नेक्स्ट वीक फॉर श्योर राइट नेक्स्ट वीक विल हैव दी वी हैव दी पार्ट टू ऑफ इट मेंटी भी तब करेंगे राइट वी कैन डू मेंटी ऑल्सो बिकॉज इफ वी डू द मेंटी नाउ the whole order will be getting disturbed right yes we will do it really very soon don't worry we will we will do it really very soon really sorry we will not be able to do the menti right we, we will talk to the team we will find a slot and we will have it clear i know that all of you want to participate in the menti but if i go ahead with menti usme questions upar niche hai so we will not be able to do the do the justice right notes i will share with you yes everyone so i think we will stop over here because we have so much more i'm telling you we have lot so a small request from all of you please make sure you read the chapter right please make sure you read the chapter thoroughly yes bahut important chapter hai because this chapter is there in class 10th also class 10th mein jaoge for sure you will be going to class 10th right and history padhna padega there is no escape so everyone i'm telling you now only this chapter is very important not just for class 8 but this chapter is there in your class 10th also so if you study now 10th mein to maze honge right i will do that guess me i'll do that yes i will be sharing the notes on the telegram right so i think with this we will end our class everyone we will have it aram say we have so much more right you can see 
though the slides look less in number but it's so much history we have so let's end our class everyone on that note thank you so much right yes tenth mein kafi maze honge agar abhi samajh liya acche se to so with this everyone i'll say bye bye do take care of yourself please make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel yes imad very good vaishnavi thank you so much bye gungun imad priya adiva pushpa your name is not pushpa i forgot your name but yeah gungun ankita ranjini deepti yes you will get the notes bye garima bye priya bye darshan bye mix back bye palak bye elsa bye pramod Shravan, Darshan, Creative Diaries, Top Gamer, Shelly, Shreya, Simran, Ahmed, Jyoti, Anushri, Creative Diaries, Krish, Aisha. Bye, bye, everyone. So we'll we will surely schedule this class. Don't worry. Please make sure to hit the like button for the video. Share with your friends and subscribe. Sayonara, ciao. बहुत सारे words हैं, right? Yes. Okay, we'll be meeting soon, everyone. And with that, we'll end our class. Good night. Do take care of yourself, and keep on learning with Byju's. Lots of love. Bye bye.